I'm Dr. Harry Anderson. I teach criminal law, criminal justice, and politics of crime control at Southampton Law School. I studied law at undergraduate level, um, attending first class honours. I then um, worked for a leading law firm. I worked for uh, local government and I worked for a mental health charity for a number of years. Before deciding I wanted to move back into academia, so I studied a master's and a PhD at Oxford University in criminology. And then I moved back to uh, University of Southampton and Southampton Law School to be a lecturer in 2013. So my research is primarily around uh, penal politics and criminal justice policy making and I've studied a number of case studies in this area so my, my biggest project so far has been looking at um, the government measures in the UK to the issue of dangerous offenders which is an incredibly topical and important issue over the last, last decade or so. Um, so this research was based on over 60 interviews with leading policy makers and has been published with Oxford University Press. The eventual goal is to try and make policy making better and, and the underlying policy better as well. So in efforts to do this so far, I've, I've um, provided evidence to the Justice Committee, uh, the Select Committee of the House of Commons. Um, I've also contributed to BBC Radio 4 documentaries, um, held a number of round tables and workshops with policy makers as well, all in terms of this kind of effort to try and make uh, policy making but also the underlying policy better. What I really, I really enjoy in terms of criminal law and criminal justice is, is seeing the students' reactions to the various policies and measures, the various laws, and often considering how they think the law could be better. I also really find it interesting to explain to the students, based on my research, how policy is actually made and to enable them to have insights into, into policy making um, and, and how these kind of things have developed. The key requirement for any law degree, I think, for any law student is to be persuasive and to be able to put forward persuasive arguments. So this requires you to be able to understand counter arguments, to really know your stuff as well, to have the knowledge there and to be able to engage in, in high level critical analysis. And I think that's something that's really valued incredibly highly by a whole range of employers far beyond, you know, including the, the legal sphere, but also far beyond this as well.